大家好，春回大地，物种迁徙，一阵会介绍一种濒危物种——春季迁移遇上嘅挑战。依家首先报道多伦多嘅乌克兰社区，本地少数族裔喜欢聚族移居，一间教堂往往又系社区中心，甚至又系餐厅添。以下会介绍一间乌克兰餐厅，位处于多伦多市中心一间乌克兰教堂嘅地牢。原本不为人熟知，但最近就多咗人关注。乌克兰餐食有何特色？李荣宇报道。喺多伦多市中心 Kensington Market 附近，有一间好特别嘅乌克兰菜式餐厅，系特别隐蔽啊！佢开喺一间教堂嘅地牢。好多时食客都要靠一个广告牌先至揾到呢间餐厅，但近来嘅社会新闻就令呢间本来好隐蔽嘅餐厅受到额外关注，多咗客人嚟帮衬，了解下佢哋嘅饮食文化。战火正在摧毁乌克兰，虽然离北美远隔千里之外，但民众唔可以隔岸观火，因为俄乌战争有机会影响全球经济。擁有肥沃土壤嘅烏克蘭有歐洲糧倉之稱。以往俄羅斯同烏克蘭合共佔全球穀物出口量近三分之一，但戰爭以嚟呢兩條重要供應鏈都已攤緩，威脅全球糧食安全。呢間餐廳嘅老闆 Tania 亦好擔心喺烏克蘭家人嘅安全。And my mom, she lives in the central part of Ukraine now with my elder sister who lives in Kiev. She joined her. They are together in Vinnytsia. We get、uh, strikes of rocket strikes and missiles here and there. If not every day, every other day. I cannot say if there is a safe place in Ukraine at this time. You don't know what to expect. One of my younger sisters has children in Romania now. And she's waiting.、Uh, I applied for her to come here. Other two younger sisters, they are on the border with Poland. They didn't decide what they want to do. If they want to be in Europe, or one of them was thinking to join me, so they still deciding. Tania 从小喺家人分途下中意煮翻两味。佢喺十六年前随丈夫移民到加拿大，有一对仔女。移民后一直从事市场推广工作。Tanya 以前经常为所在教会，即系餐厅楼上嘅教堂，整啲乌克兰特色菜嚟筹款。终于喺三年前，于教堂地牢开咗呢间乌克兰菜式餐厅。We had really nice traditional gatherings, and every Sundays we've been making borscht, it's Ukrainian soup, and baking pampushki, like baked bread, with filling inside. We've been making varenike or pierogi too. It's very traditional Ukrainian meal, cabbage rolls, you know, schnitzels, all kind of.、Um, Traditional meals, and、um, uh, our family is large in Ukraine. We've been getting together. Pierogi, 望落好似餃子咁，係烏克蘭特色食品。裡面包住薯蓉同 cheddar 芝士，通常點啲 sour cream 嚟食，好似套餐上嘅主食咁，食多兩隻都幾飽肚。呢碗紅色嘅濃菜湯係羅宋湯。有別於我哋平時喺茶餐廳飲，用野菜、洋葱、番茄同芹菜等大雜燴嘅羅宋湯，烏克蘭嘅羅宋湯主要用紅菜頭嚟煮，仲有呢塊香口嘅炸雞扒。Tania 先用錘仔打鬆啲雞肉，然後飲啲煎炸用嘅粉漿同麵包碎，再放入滾油度炸，食落零舍香脆鬆嫩。俄乌战争受世界关注以嚟，教堂上下都多咗人流。除咗多咗人帮衬 Tania 嘅乌克兰菜餐厅之外，楼上嘅多伦多圣弗拉基米尔东正教堂亦增加祈祷聚会嘅次数，为社区内一啲担忧家乡嘅乌克兰移民提供一个抒发情感嘅出口。根据呢间教堂嘅神父 Dr. Bruciora 介绍，喺乌克兰，东正教同天主教为两个最大教派。而呢间东正教堂早喺一九四八年落成，信徒主要系嚟自乌克兰嘅移民家庭。神父最近听得最多嘅分享，当然系会众对俄乌战争嘅担忧，同佢哋喺乌克兰当地受战火影响家人嘅一啲苦况。And for me at this moment to say I understand you, it will be a false statement because only the person knows. I can be there, I can assist, I can hug, I can give some kind of comfort. I can help with prayer, 
one of the members of my family said, Father, please help me because my husband's parents who lived in Kiev got notified to leave the apartment because of the bombardments. Can you imagine in 15 minutes to collect whatever you have and not knowing when you're going to find yourself next day? He went to Romania. Thanks to the Ukrainian uh, embassy, they got papers in Romania and then uh, they, he brought them to Canada. They're almost over 80 years old each. 无论系地理位置，定系历史渊源，俄罗斯同乌克兰都环环相扣，甚至曾经有争论，究竟罗宋汤出自俄罗斯定系乌克兰？可惜如今两国却以冰火相见。Tania 热爱家乡乌克兰嘅文化，亦担心文化传统会喺战争中被摧毁。You know Ukrainian culture is so rich. Unfortunately, we went through many wars. <laughs> And we went through famine, Holodomor. We survived so many things. Like if you remember, then was Orange Revolution. Then it was time when um, in 2014 when Crimea was taken, and now we go through war. So sometimes I think how, for how long Ukrainians will suffer because uh, I grew up on a history knowing that Ukrainians been been going through so much, and after that we remain humans, very courageous and strong people. Now it's disastrous, and as you know, a lot of cities been destroyed, and about four million of Ukrainians are refugees looking for help. Panmong Jin Fo 早日结束，让乌克兰当地人民重回和平嘅日子。世界亦不至于喺疫情肆虐下遭受额外损失。